For anyone curious about Windows 11 and how it may affect your CPU performance, the YouTube channel Microsoft Mechanics with Steve Dispensa, who is the Vice President of Enterprise Management at Microsoft, is running through some of the improvements that we'll see with the next iteration of Windows. These improvements range from the CPU, storage, and memory of your device. So almost every market from gaming to productivity should see some type of improvement. In the video, he explains that Microsoft Windows 11 will save almost 37% of usage on the CPU and 32% when utilizing memory. Dispensa explains that there was an emphasis on hibernation times for Windows 11. It also explains that Windows 11 will start significantly quicker from sleep modes when compared to Windows 10. All of this is on the hardware level though. On the software level, Windows 11 will optimize power for threads, making sure that no power is wasted and is only transferred when needed. It is stated that Windows 11 will resume from its sleep state up to 25% faster when compared to Windows 10. Microsoft Windows 11 has dramatically altered the look and added new UI with faster animations. It also changed out the taskbar, which some people have find less than helpful, although they have added a plethora of different features, one specifically, is a feature for multi-monitor setup, allowing the system to remember where certain windows are on certain displays to help increase productivity. Windows 11 is set to launch on October 5th, 2021, and will be a free upgrade to Windows 10 users. In addition to the Windows 11 announcement, we may have also had the Intel Alder Lake CPU pictured with both the Z690 chipset and the LGA 1700 socket detailed. These pictures of the Intel Alder Lake CPU were released by Video Cards, which states that the processor pictured is an engineering sample, but in front of the CPU showcases the words Intel Confidential. The main difference between an engineering sample and a confidential sample is that, that the confidential press sample is the final revision of the silicone, which is read by the BIOS with the retail name of the CPU instead of the placeholder, which is normally Intel 0000. The 12th gen Intel Alder Lake CPUs will feature 16 lanes of PCIe 5.0, which can be bifurcated into either 1x16 design or 2x8 design. Interestingly, Intel is going with the Intel UHD graphics nomenclature, as opposed to the XE, which might be an attempt to bifurcate their high-end graphics efforts away from low-end iGPUs. An X8 DMI 4.0 link connects the CPU to the chipset. Now coming to the chipset side, up to 12 PCIe 4.0 lanes and up to 16 lanes of PCIe 3.0 lanes will be provided by the platform. Six SATA 6 gigabyte ports will also be present with up to four USB 3.2 Gen 2x2 ports, 10 USB 3.2 Gen 2x1 ports, and 10 USB 3.2 Gen 1x1 ports, and 16 USB 2.0 ports. Intel Platform Trust technology, which is critical for Windows 11, is also present. Intel Optane memory support and Intel Smart Sound technology support are also provided through the chipset. Let us know what you think. Will Windows 11 be the huge upgrade that Microsoft wants it to be, or will it be another Windows 8? Let us know in the comments down below, and don't forget to subscribe for more fantastic tech news.